Hi everyone! Barcelona have decided on their top transfer target and it will definitely surprise you. Also, as always, we have a lot of interesting transfer news to cover. Support us with a like and comment down below. Without further ado, let's get the show on the pitch! Real Betis want to get the Vitor Roca deal done today. Verbal agreement is almost done with Barca on the loan move, with the club still in talks about clauses and details, as the loan could be valid until 2026, which is two years. Atletico Madrid have presented their newest signings, Julian Alvarez and Conor Gallagher, at their home stadium, the Metropolitano. Mats Hummels arrived in Spain for talks with Mallorca, reports Florian Plattenberg. Negotiations between Arsenal and Nottingham Forest over the transfer of Edin Ketia are entering final stages. Juventus have signed Pierre Kalulu from AC Milan with an option to buy for 14 plus 3 million euros. Atalanta are interested in Fenerbahce defender Rodrigo Becao. Sevilla have reached an agreement with Brighton over the signing of the English club's left-back Valentin Barco. He will join the Rocky Blancos on a one-year loan deal without a buy option. Paolo Dybala has given the green light to his move to al Qatsiya as the Saudi Pro League outfit offers Roma around 3 million euros. Cristiano Ronaldo's YouTube channel set a record, taking only 90 minutes to reach 1 million subscribers. Como have successfully secured the services of Nico Paz from Real Madrid, who will receive 6 million euros for him plus 50% sell-on clause for future sale. Manchester United right winger Facundo Pellistri has become a player of Panathinaikos with his contract valid for four years. According to insider Fabrizio Romano, the transfer fee amounted to 6 million euros. Besides, the Red Devils will receive a percentage from the player's future sale. Emiliano Martinez has inked a new five-year contract with Aston Villa. Bayern Munich's Manuel Neuer has called time on his international career with Germany. The goalkeeper himself announced the matter on his Instagram page. Nantes goalkeeper Alban Lafon could move to Ajax, West France reports. Newcastle United are considering a move for Chelsea's winner Noni Madueke, according to insider Nicolo Skira. Napoli have announced the transfer of Benfica's David Neres. The Eagles will receive 30 million euros for their winner. Sterling and Chilwell are training apart. Those who want minutes, they are better off to leave claimed Anto Maresca. When I saw Rodrigo, Vini, Mbappe and Bellingham running towards me, I just prayed to God, shared Mallorca defender Pablo Maffeo. Juventus centre-back Daniele Rugani has joined Ajax on a season-long loan until the summer of 2025. Liverpool, Bayern Munich and Inter Milan are keen on signing Adrien Rabiot, L'Equipe reports. PSG and Reims have sealed a loan deal for midfielder Gabriel Moscardo. The Parisians have sent him for a one-year loan with a clause to break it early in January. The contract also includes salary coverage. Alvaro Morata will miss two to three weeks of action due to a muscle injury and is unlikely to be involved in Spain's Nations League games in the September international break. Sergio Roberto's move to Como as a free agent is at the final stage. Fiorentina are in talks with Juventus over a possible loan for Philippe Kostic. David Hansko is close to joining Atletico Madrid from Feyenoord for 30 million euros. Villarreal have completed the signing of Basel forward Tierno Bari for 14 million euros. Aston Villa's 31-year-old Spanish left-back Alex Moreno has joined Nottingham Forest on a season-long loan deal. The Foresters will also have the option to buy the footballer's contract. Liverpool are open to sell its centre-back Sepp van den Berg. Bayer Leverkusen and Bradford are interested in him. Guys, now it's time to subscribe to our channel and like this video. Thank you! Let's have a look at the results from yesterday's matches. Moving on to the main news of the release. Napoli are making progress in talks with Chelsea regarding the transfer of Romelu Lukaku. Within the next 24 hours, the Napoli director will meet with Chelsea representatives in London to come to a final decision. All parties involved in negotiations expect Lukaku to become the Parthenopians player in the coming days. Manchester City are showing interest in Celtic striker Kyogo Furuhashi. The 29-year-old Japan international could replace Julian Alvarez, who recently made the switch to Atletico for 75 plus 25 million euros. 
Thus, the Sky Blues are considering entering the transfer market to find a replacement for him, with the option of recruiting Furuhashi being on the table. The Premier League Titans will only discuss the possibility of a move if the right option becomes available. However, no decision has been made on any player yet. Kyogo Furuhashi has been representing Celtic since the summer of 2021, when he arrived from the Japanese side of Isil Kobe for just over 5 million euros. Here's the transfer story. During his three-year spell at the club, the Japanese made 135 appearances, scored 73 goals and delivered 16 assists. Kyogo's current deal with Celtic runs until 2027. Atletico Madrid ace João Félix has joined Chelsea, signing a seven-year contract with the London club. Earlier on, it was reported that Chelsea would pay 65 million euros for the Portuguese, 35 million up front and another 30 million over time. But then it turned out that these rumors were not accurate. It must be recalled that the striker has already performed for the Blues in the second half of the 2022-23 season on a loan deal. He hates sports. <laughs> Bro, come on! He managed to score four goals in 20 appearances. England midfielder Conor Gallagher has become an Atletico Madrid player. Previously, Fabrizio Romano reported that Chelsea received 42 million for their now former representative. The contract runs until 2029 and it was signed last week. <laughs> Barcelona midfielder Ilkay Gundogan will return to Manchester City. As reported by Fabrizio Romano, the citizens and the Germany international have reached an agreement on a transfer. Ilkay will quit Barcelona for free and pan a contract with the reigning Premier League champions until June 2025. The deal could be officially announced today. Barcelona sporting director Daco met a fan who was concerned about the club signings and told him that the transfer of Athletic Bilbao winner Nico Williams is off the table so far. Will Nico come? I want him to come, but he doesn't want to. But will anyone else come? Yes, assured Daco. Nico has been part of the Lions system since 2013. Juventus ace Federico Chiesa could end up at Barcelona, who are ready to open talks with Juventus regarding the Italian's move. To elaborate, the winner is asking for a contract that runs until 2028 and believes that Barcelona is the best place where he can further develop his career. Juventus demand 15 million euros for their star. By the way, the player's agent Fali Ramadani is already working on a deal. Folks, we would like to invite you to our Football Club channel, where you will find out what is actually happening at Barcelona. Have a great time watching!